Hi, my name is Nick. <laughs> oh God, dude. Don't do that. My name is Chris. I'm Mike. Hello, everyone. Everybody knows that guy's name. That was telekinetic. <laughs> you the names in? You say my name and I'll move my lips. Okay. And I'll say your name. Okay. Okay, cool, go. <laughs> hey, I'm Nick. Hi, I'm Chris. I'm Mike. Hello, I'm Tyson. <laughs> <laughs> The last 22 months of my life have been the most incredible. It's like, it's like a wedding every day, except you're the groom. I don't want, no, no, it's not a wedding. It's like a funeral. You know how weird a funeral is? How that whole day is just weird as shit? Like every day, no, it's not a funeral. It's too depressing. Every day is Christmas morning, but it's like Groundhog's Day. It's just like Groundhog's Day. Like you wake up, and you're doing it every day. So 22 months later, here I am. Here we are. Um, I feel very good about it. I'm just tired of shit. This is uh, where, after the show, we will hang our slabs of dried meat. Here's our uh, leather skin uh, barber chair. It comes mm. with us everywhere. Actually, this is plastic. I asked for real calf skin. It's probably like five weeks into the tour. And uh, it's almost Christmas time. Been doing a lot of online shopping. Mm. I got Grandma and Grandpa a DVD VCR combo. Sh so how are you guys doing? I'm good, good. How about you? No, I'm good, thank you. What's up? This what's your name, dude? Paul. Paul, what's up, man? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, no. Those no, shirts are good no, for yeah, something. Don't, not on the shirts. <laughs> Mind if I set this down? Oh, yeah, yeah sure. sure. Thank you. I'll show you. Here you go. Check here. this out. Oh, Let's show this. you. Check this out. You put your finger right there. Right there. Push down. Right there. And don't touch the other string. Just like that one string. And then you play the last four strings. Keep it off the metal. Off the metal. Right. You see that right there, bro? Yeah. Keep it off the metal. You got it? It'll hold it up for you. Maybe it's one, two, three, go. Last, last four. Oh. Yeah. 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 That was right. awesome. It started here. Hey, thank, thank you so, so much. <laughs> wow. I'm here. I was like, who else? Hey. You. you came on a very uh, <laughs> unique day. This doesn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, <laughs> Always no. showered with gifts. Yeah. Whoa. That's pretty saucy, man. Let's get a free Ooh, so. Look at the Happy box. Days, enjoy. No Dude, way. Thank you guys. All you gotta do is smile and take a trade shot with us. Oh, awesome. easy enough. I'm extremely easy to pick on. I'll tell you that. If it's a dude in the band that gets a lot of shit, it's me. And uh, if you can figure out why, I'd like to know so I can change that. But I'm pretty sure it's something I'm doing. No, actually, no. Fuck that. It's because the other three guys are assholes. Oh, Jesus. It's getting off my burn. Where are you? Mercy is for the weak. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta go your bus. <laughs> okay. No, You're in uh, Ventura, California. A big fair going on outside where you can buy funnel cakes and get a uh, face paint and uh, henna tattoos, all the good fair stuff, you know what I mean? And I went to Starbucks this morning and there was a sign on the door that said, closed due to toxic fumes, we'll be back open at 2.45, sorry for the inconvenience. <laughs> it's like toxic fumes, all right, man. I was, I was bummed because I just woke up and there was a Starbucks a block away that never happens on tour where it's that close. One day it is, toxic fumes ruin it for me, man. Bumps me out. 
on this tour we've started doing something we've never done before, which is uh, have sound check parties every day with our fan clubs. It's been awesome, you know, and I, I think kids dig it. You ain't got shit without fans, right? And you know, I think we, we come from a, a place where our parents would, you know, slap us if we didn't say thank you for something. Oh, sure. Awesome. All right, I'm gonna take him as okay. well. He's doing pretty good. How you guys? Thank you. Right on. Oh, Lord. How do you feel, sir? <laughs> feel pretty good. It's not every day you get beautiful ladies asking to kiss you. I feel pretty amazing. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. This is Officer Suckett. Um, that's her real name. Don't laugh. She's, uh, she's our friend who might or might not come out on stage tonight. You know, it depends on how the crowd is. But what we do is uh, tile throw her out and ask the audience to clothe her. Um, usually she comes back with several bras and shirts. Um, nobody usually gives up their pants, sometimes shoes. Um, tonight won't be hats because she's already equipped with one. It says police on it, by the way. Um, you know, we'll see what happens. Here, spread her. That's it, dude. Your wrist is in the way. I'm gonna pop it. Oh. <laughs> yeah, hey, look at that, look at that. Here, splice this in with, uh, with, <laughs> with the shot of me throwing it. Oh. Up the brown, out the brown, out brown. Out brown, doesn't he have a show on the Food Network? A few of you will get that joke. <laughs> the steam. I recommend it. But, uh, I recommend a lot of shit. People who like steam, you're gonna love this product. It's a kettle. And all it does is steam. Everything broke for me at the first half of the set, but it was a fun way. Actually, it's kind of a challenge, a bit, bit of a challenge for me. Something about a breast bowl. Yeah! <laughs> High five, dude. Clam chowder in a breast bowl. Dude, Panera bread would pay big bucks for that. Funny, it doesn't quite look like Seattle. It's not a white outline of the skyline with uh, the Fraser Frasier written underneath it. <laughs> We're going 
going to the Seattle Supersonics game. Do not ask me what sporting event this is because I do not know. Basketball. Thank you. We went to a, a pro basketball game the other day in Seattle. We went to a Seattle Sonics game. We got floor seats. And I don't care, you can hate basketball, but if you watch a game from the floor, it is exciting. I've never had the danger of being hit by a basketball before. So it'll be pretty fun. Duty, come on in. <laughs> this is this is our uh, our front lounge. Yeah. Two TVs. And you're asking yourself, why are they on the sides of the wall? So we can 69. It's we we'll both. We we'll both be watching the same show. We won't miss anything. This is the kitchen. We wanted a nice the kitchen. flow to it, like feng shui, so we didn't really want any barriers to separate the kitchen, which is the heart of the home, it's really linear. from the living area. Welcome to the dining room. Yeah. Um, again, we went with the flow. We wanted it to be one seamless integration of everything in our daily life. Chris put a lot of time into it. There's the uh, shitter with the... Um, a little pee in it. Oh, uh, Jeez, I wish we had somewhere to make out. Me too. Sexy. What can we do about that? There we can make a bed. Isn't that nice? Epic. This is my room. This is uh, this is my filth. It's fucking awful. It, take, it took four months to get this bad one. So. And all those uh, Kleenexes on the floor, I, I blow my nose a lot. <sighs> He's got a cold. All the time. <laughs> Charities. This one is a charity for boobs. Um, not, not, see, this isn't for breast cancer. This is actually just for boobs. <laughs> We're at the Hotel Monaco. <sighs> Caviar is waiting for us. <laughs> Where's our room? I don't know. I'm freaking out. <laughs> All I'm gonna do is poop and shower, man. I will start shaving here in the lobby. That's what I'm talking about. Well, at least it's somewhat of a sweet. Red ones. <laughs> I collect these things, man, from all the different Kempton hotels. Really? Yeah, I, got I collect all my Australian pins. I got all the colors, man. I don't collect <laughs> keys, I collect pins from the hotels, as opposed to the keys. Uh, yes. I've had a lot of nerve issues on this tour. Um, it's about to get graphic, kids. <laughs> I've been coughing a lot, and um, I've been shitting my brains out nightly. Not on days off. So I think it's uh, I think it's all nerves about the show, and this whole DVD thing isn't really helping. Because we get one shot, and uh, we haven't done it yet. It's like a week away, and um, my left ear is just ringing like crazy all of a sudden.
freaking cold. Listen. Dance floor really is for dancing. This floor is not. What do you have today, guys? Dude, carrots. It's catering. Gotta eat your shit. Gotta eat your shit. No, 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 no. Stop. Bring the beat back. Everybody get the shit. We have entertainment. Wait, what? Played here three times in our career. No more than that. Four times max. Definitely probably the least touched town. One of the top five least touched towns by the All American Rejects. Denver, Colorado. Right in the nice Andes Mountains. <laughs> or the Alps, I forget. I'm trying to learn how to breathe here. It's hard. <clears throat> we shall get drunk tonight, because we'll do it on two beers. Okay, we're gonna call Travis. Have him get us the fucking stout shit. <laughs> Today's one of them days where we got too much shit to fit in the club. Um, I'm gonna decide if we want projection or not. Um, I'll let you know. He has probably got about 15 minutes for us. It's gonna get noisy. Okay. Sweet. Sorry, I'm Hi, I'm Nick. And I'm Mike. We're in the All American Rejects. And you're watching Mania TV. Hi, I'm Nick. And I'm Mike. We're in the All American Rejects. And you're watching Sugar High. Hi, I'm Nick. And I'm Mike. We are in a band called the All American Rejects. And apparently, we are artists of the day. High five. Yes! Dying this. I'm shaving this after the uh, after the DVD shoot. God, I hate that thing. Every time you get near it, fucking. Howdy. I hate it. Um, afterwards, I'm gonna cut it. I'm done with that. I'm gonna go to the R and B, the chin strap, and I won't have to dye it because it comes in thicker. My hair is so blonde. It grows in so thin right here. To look really creepy, I have to dye it. Um, so it's been almost a year to the day since the last time we talked to you guys. Um, it's been quite a year for you guys. So, uh, what does it feel like to be you right now? I'm a lot more tired. Yeah, yeah, we haven't gone home much in a year, so... No, it, it was a good year, though. It's yeah. probably the best year of our lives. I, I, I wish, uh, we weren't so lethargic and tired <laughs> right now, or else we'd seem a lot more enthused about it. See her? What do you want to know? 
4.49 p.m. I haven't brushed my teeth today. Ew. Smell it. I haven't eaten cheese. I think most people know this already, but the people that don't, every time I poop, I get a boner. It's true. I think the poop tickles my prostate and arouses me. And so I have to jizz onto the turd. So it's like poo in the toilet with little sperm wads on top of it. We got a cake from Mr. Brad Stoner, our stage manager. It's his birthday. And apparently he's a dick, according to uh, the uh, wording on his penis cake. And we're going to pre uh, present it during uh, the show. Here we are in the natural after show environment. All right. No, don't talk quiet. Don't talk loudly because it might disturb them. All right. Let's look in on our after show in the natural environment. Look over here. Over here we have a Dave Lopez in its perfect pristine beauty. Look as he scratches, about to pounce, but practically ready to attack. You never know. His chemical imbalance is insane. Oh, let's move over to the right. Here is a pavin. Now, these are very rare, ladies and gentlemen. We are seeing something that nature never reveals, and that is a pavin completely still. Usually they flap their wings. And you can't see them like a hummingbird. Let's move to the right. Here is a crouched shabba ready to pounce. He's is an animal. Notice he wears his, he wears his hat. But that is merely a mating device. <laughs> That's how he lures his prey. And it's over. It's just like that. Nature is just beautiful. It's there for a second and then gone. Thank you for joining me. This has been Nature Watch. The what? I think it blew it. Well, if it blew it, there'd be an awful lot. Did a lot of smoke come out? Yeah. She won't even roll over. I tried to start her from back here. Here I stand with one problem. Motor just seized up. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> our bus, I love our bus. <laughs> it's such a good bus. Now it's dead. It's moments like these, you just can't. You can't pay for comedy like this. No, no not at all. It's Christmas. <laughs> it's Christmas. <laughs> Beautiful Kansas City, Missouri. Unless this is Kansas. Is this Missouri or Kansas? This is Missouri. Beautiful Kansas City, Missouri. Um, anyway, so our bus broke down last night and we were forced to move out and uh, move on to the production bus, which was actually quite glorious. I woke up to Bob, the accountant, saying, Hey, we're here! Get up! Woo doggy! Uh, we don't have that on our bus. We just sleep and then when we wake up, we stumble off, wonder where the hell we are, and then call Shaba and say, hey, what do I do? We're gonna attempt to get uh, some Christmas shopping done, because uh, I don't think anybody's gotten too much. From hotel, turn left on McGee Street. What's this street? Eating is. Eating is fun. Eating is serious. Eat too much, you're gonna delirious. Eat too little, you're gonna disappear. So we're going Christmas shopping. That'd be a good cadaver thing. There's gotta be a bank around here somewhere. You can adjust your height. If only you could see what I'm feeling. 
I never need a woman again. Thank you. Coming in, guys. Yeah. All right. I've bought nothing so far today. Very far behind. I've gotten several ideas, however. So, still in Kansas City. After a long, hard day of Christmas shopping, we find ourselves on the 41st floor in a spinning cocktail lounge. Um, enjoying a wonderful local Boulevard Weed beer. After another one of these, however, the spinning probably isn't going to be as cool. We've got three more shows. Then the fourth will be the filming of the DVD. Um, starting to get down on the wire. Look at this. Green Bay, Wisconsin. Just waking up off the bus. Sometimes you just gotta put a bitch in his place. When Chris Gaylor, sure he may have got me in some fucking locks and some moves, but I punched his fucking dick. This is what I do. I let them think they're winning. They like, got me some grapple. I'm like, oh, oh, oh. Tapping out. Big oh, punch. Oh, oh. There's no rules. You have to be delicate with someone as fragile as me. <coughs> yeah, I can take my dick punches. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do that. It's Chris. Nice to meet you, man. Thanks for coming out. Today, I'm John. How are you, man? I'm really, uh, it's really weird. I've never done anything like this before. So it's a bit nerve wracking. I'm by myself. Hey, how's it going? How you doing, man? Everybody, thanks for coming out to Henry's. We've got Chris Gaylor here tonight for the All American Rejects. Let's give it up there. All right. Straight from Oklahoma. Yeah. Hey, man. How you doing? Pretty good, you? Yeah, I'm doing well. I'm stoked for him, man. He's, uh, he was definitely nervous, but looks like he's gotten over pretty fast. What are I'm getting really fast at the sign of those. Those yeah. usually are hard to do. Boyd, hold the button down until it flashes. Yeah. Do the in there. Yeah. Good. Magic. Well, I'm feeling good about the show tonight. I had a, uh, two days off in between. I got a show, day off show. Day off? That's what you need to survive. Shut up, Travis. Basically, right now we're doing pre-show rituals, which includes our uh, wig of the of the bay, which I haven't put on yet. This thing's not cheap. And the love doll. Well, this thing rides low. Yeah. Hey, you guys ever seen uh, Rock-A-Doodle, that movie? <laughs> I feel like the lead chicken in Rock-A-Doodle. Basically, Travis has been uh, massaging my feet for the last 45 minutes because they're dying. <laughs> He's laughing because he had to bring out the pumice stone, didn't you? The stone, yeah. yeah, dude, my bunions were terrible, but you knocked them. <laughs> Gaylor's been uh, throwing yeah, up yeah, against the wall and then oh, seeing how long it takes to get to water. Um, yeah, Nick yeah, Wheeler has been actually doing cock uh, flexing, which he blows his penis up in a uh, penis pump and then flexes it, flexes it, flexes it. Did you burst a blood vessel today? No, but I'm so veiny. Basically. No, basically, his, his, the end of his dick looks like he's got gin blossoms. Bradley, can you manage to back door here, please? people are famous is when you put 50 fucking armed security guards around them.
I'm nervous as fuck. I hate days like this. Let's go to the reverse one again just for a second. Double check it. I'm going to get this done. So I don't have to worry about it anymore. I think I'm ready. I'm on fire. Just a little insight will make this right. Too late to fight. It ends tonight. It ends when darkness turns to light. It ends tonight. Thank <laughs> you.